Hi, Leah with my sewing room. Today I'm gonna to walk you through the special tricks you need to have under your belt to thread a Bernina 8 series successfully. I'm gonna walk through the threading on an 830 today. When you are setting up to thread your Bernina 8 series machine, you'll need to remove the dust cover off your thread stand. Pull gently upward, it does lock in place. You can also raise your aerial and then let's talk about where your threads might go on this spool stand. There's three places to put your threads. Your front one can be used to wind a bobbin. Your back one is great for stack wound threads, such as those with the crisscross lines all the way across. And your center one has a spinning foam pad. Your spinning pad is designed for stack wound threads so that they can spool off sideways and you'll guide them through the small hole in the gray plastic. Let's start by winding a bobbin. To wind a bobbin, place your thread, if it's cross wound, on that front spool pin, and then you can guide it up through the double aerial on the top. You can place your bobbin silver side outward on the spindle for the bobbin winder. Your first thread guide is at the bottom of the spool stand. Then you're gonna wrap the thread counterclockwise around the button tensioner at the bottom. And then you can wrap your thread around your bobbin several times. Your last step before hitting go on your bobbin winder is to cut the thread off behind the silver spot. You can turn the bobbin winder on using your screen. In your bobbin winder, you have the choice of having your bobbins fill to 25%, 50%, or 100%. You're also able to change the speed of your bobbin winder using the stitch width knob. For specialty threads, you may want to slow your bobbin winding down. If you want to stop, not at a set percentage, you're free to stop the bobbin winder using the button on screen. When you're done and your bobbin's ready to go, you can just cut it back off and it's ready to install in your machine. When you're first getting to know your Bernina 8 series machine, I highly recommend sewing with your service door off. To remove your service door, you'll use your multifunction tool that comes with your machine. The little bar sticking out to the side can be inserted at the side of the machine, and all you need to do is push inwards gently. This is not a prying action. Your door will pop off. When you start threading your machine, your machine has a sensor up under here. It's very important that you guide the thread upward, give it a little tug, and let the machine make all its noises before proceeding. You'll guide the thread along the top of the machine, and taking it behind the little silver tension disc and then pull gently down the side and the front of the machine. It'll come out the bottom near where your needle is. Your thread guide here, you'll want to get your thread behind the little guide wire. After that, guide the thread gently over into the white thread guide, and then go up and over the side thread cutter. At this point, you're ready to select the needle threading button on the front of the machine. The automatic threader on your Bernina 8 series machine is really quite happy with needles sized 80 and up or regular weight threads. Really, really thick threads or really, really skinny needles are not going to be a happy combination on this machine. When you go to remove the thread on your Bernina 8 series, it's vital that you clip the thread at the spool and pull it out needle direction. Inside your machine, there's a whole bunch of metal bits that like to eat thread 
and your service tech doesn't really like picking thread out of there for you. If you've placed a specialty foot on your machine, such as a Bernina walking foot or the number 50 foot, it's important to use the manual threading function with your needle threader. You'll start the same way as regular threading with the tug up at the top at the beginning and guiding the thread all the way across the top of the machine and down the front into the needle thread guide. Rather than placing the thread in your threader guide, you're going to select manual threading on screen. The manual threading symbol on all Bernina 8 series involves a little hand and the needle. This will let the machine know that you still need to thread the inner part of the machine, but it will not thread the needle for you. You'll select the threading button again, and the inside portion of the threading mechanism will activate. This places the thread under the check spring. It's vital that you still press the white button when doing manual threading, otherwise your thread does not get in all the places it needs to be. At this point, you get to manually thread that needle. Your Bernina 8 series will also not manually thread, automatically thread the needle if you've selected the number 50 foot for this reason. Now that the top of our machine is threaded, let's install a bobbin. To install the bobbin on your Bernina 8 series machine, you'll need to gently open your bobbin door and let the machine roll the hook outward. To remove a bobbin, gently press the center button slightly to the left and the bobbin will pop outwards. Give it a little pull and it should come right out. When you go to install a new bobbin, it's important that the silver on the outside of the bobbin faces out towards you. Try and avoid touching those silver bits as they do flake off and will cause bobbin reading issues down the road. Guide the thread over the top of the bobbin and down in through the small slit on the right hand side. Using your finger, guide the thread underneath the bobbin and pull about two full revolutions or roughly 18 inches of thread off the, off the bobbin. What you're looking for now is the thread to be under the spring. Your Bernina 8 series came with a small mirror to help you ensure that the thread is in the correct place. When the thread is guiding outward from the fork shaped spring, you'll be able to cut it using the thread cutter on the left hand side. Now you're ready to roll the hook back into the machine. Gently close the door and the hook will return to sewing position. If you need to use alternate threading on your Bernina 8 series for embroidery or decorative stitching, you'll guide the thread along the outside of the thread guide rail and pop it into the paper clip shaped spring guide. Now it will be coming out of the fork shaped piece and in through the paper clip shaped piece.